It is so hot today. And I feel guilty about not going outside because it's a beautiful day. But I also have a lot of stuff that I have to do. I spent the morning cleaning. I have the fan on. I hope it's not too loud and doesn't interrupt the sound. I got some frozen berries here to like feed myself and cool down. I also don't have many groceries, so I should be out buying food. I don't know what I'm going to do. I think Sunday is probably a great day to do live videos. And I need to get these out of the way. These are taking up space. So these particular ones I got to open. So I'm going to open them up. And I think we'll all have a great time. Which one do I start with? Hey, carpet bag monkey. Scotland's an awesome place. I love Monster High. Woohoo! Cleo. Which one do I do first? You guys are here. Oh, every. I already got two Cleos before I even asked the question, so it looks like Cleo's first. Maybe I did ask the question. I don't even remember. I don't know how hot it is here, but I am so hot. Wait, I should start with some berries first. Out of all these ones, I don't know, I guess. I guess Cleo would be my favorite out of all these ones, too. I'm really excited to get the brand new ballerina Cleo. I think that one looks so good. I saw some people complaining about that. I don't get it. I think it's like probably the best Monster High doll ever. Hey. Hey, um. <laughs> I do need my glasses. Hey, Forbins. Hey, Hannah. Hey, Mad. All Exol You made me give you total spies for this. What? <laughs> Maybe I'm reading it wrong. Would oh, you know something that I did not prepare for? I didn't bring my I didn't bring any scissors over. Where's my opening box? I do see my opening box. I do like that these open. I do this. I prefer this kind of packaging. I like the spines. They're easier to open. This one, they were nice. The cardboard was nice, and you can open them, but they're much more easily destroyed, and they don't. The boxes don't hold up as well. You watch Total Spies too. Oh, Totally Spies. I don't know that show. It's a show? Should I watch it? Do you recommend it? Maybe... May maybe you guys are talking... Maybe you guys are talking about Sailor Moon. I don't know much about that. Hey, I didn't really show the packaging. So I guess you can get four in the series. I think I actually have the whole collection. If you watched my collection video, you might have seen that I have all of those. Maybe I don't have all of those. Hey, I'm not sure. I think I have them all. Oh. Is it an animated show? Is Total Spies an animated show? Or is it a cartoon? I can see that she already looks super duper pretty in here. Once I got the dingy old box off, 
She looks so sparkly clean and new and she looks really good. Total Spies 2018. That means it's a new show. Hi Jason, what do you think about the Toys R Us? <laughs> that it's broke. Well, as far as I know, as far as I understand, it's not closing. So that's really strange. And you know, the, the one of the most interesting things that I think about the whole Toys R Us closing thing is that uh, that the the um the ones that are international, not the North American ones, will remain open. They are a totally different entity, and it won't affect them. So they would continue on. So all you international fans would have would continue to have Toys R Us's opened. But so far it's not closing. What I understand is that they're just going bankrupt, reorganizing their financials and giving it another go. I think the thing is that they're supposed to be focusing on the babies. I've noticed that they've already started focusing on the babies anyway. But, I don't know. How Do you guys like to go toy shopping, or do you prefer to buy them cheaply from Amazon? Um, take your... No. <laughs> Mad, what does that mean? Do you guys watch... R-W-B-Y. I don't know what that is. What is your figure saying? Oh, that's some... The Octonaut... The Octonaut Compass is talking over there. It doesn't... Be, it doesn't be quiet. Hey, great to see another Canadian. Yeah, Canada! Are you in the hot part of Canada? It's 40 degrees here. I should be out enjoying the weather. I should be at the beach. I should be doing some... I have a feeling that there'd be a lot of people there. And I also really like to clean in the daylight. I had a lot of stuff I had to do around here, so I decided to stay in. Look how pretty she is. Hey Jason, new subscriber here. Recommended from Diamonds Dollies. Thanks for watching. Yes, we are in Montreal. Oh yeah, Montreal would be hot too. I love Montreal. I used to live there for probably, I don't know, five, six years? I liked it. The politics is hard, though. Why aren't you at the pool? should be at the pool. Oh, I was also going to do... My pool is closed. I do have some reviews left over. We expected that um, winter had set in because it's Canada and it's September, but no. Yeah, she's a really cool Cleo. Check out that belt and these shoes with just one tiny bit of paint. Hey, Doll's brand new look. I think Cleo's full name is Cleopatra. It's Cleo... Sandra, I think. I think it's Cleo Denial. Afternoon, classes, Monster High, awesome. Um, we just bought my niece a Money, Money High doll. She's three. We got her one of those fear leading. Oh, that's definitely a good choice. Because um, not too many small parts. The paint comes off on the shoes. Be careful of that, though. Yeah, it's really hot here in Chicago. Beautiful hair. Is it not box hair? The hat's nice. Um, when I look at these faces of the old ones, it really makes me appreciate the new ones. It's just... They look a lot like brats. I, um think they're a bit too old and hoochy. I like the cute ones a lot better. Alright, let's move on to Laguna from the same series. Here's her box. 
She doesn't look anything like this artwork. Nice. The shoes are cute. Hey Jason, great to see another live stream. I'm a new subscriber. Thanks for subscribing. Uh, me and Diamond's Dollies, are we going to do a collaboration? Well, we're in, we're very far away from each other. I know that she wants to send me a package, so I will probably send her a package back. I have to find out what she wants, though. So that's kind of a collaboration. Um, R-Y-B-Y is an anime I recommend. Oh, well, I only like classic anime, like, well, I only like Astro Boy. And when Astro Boy was around, we called it Japanimation. You know what I forgot? I forgot, and I left her purse in the bag. It's very, very similar to Laguna's purse. That's why it made me think of it. Frights camera action. Did that take place in New York? Does anyone know? Did you watch the movie? I want Draculaura. <laughs> it's my favorite, but some has weird eyes. Uh, Jay, please don't trash talk <laughs> the originals. Oh, sorry about that, Catalina. They look a bit hoochy, I'm just saying. No daughter of mine would be allowed to leave the house at this age in this outfit. Let me tell ya. You should open a Ouija for Halloween. Um, yeah, that's the plan. I think uh, Luke will be opening that. The Lukes will be playing with the Ouija board. We'll see what, who they talk to. Uh, I have some of the original Monster High dolls and all of the elastics in their legs keep popping off. The elastics in their legs? Do they have a lot? Where do they have elastics in their life? Do you mean the old, these elastics? That is so sweet. It's a shame you live so far apart. You should open a Ouija for Halloween. Oh yeah, I read that. Do you have to fix that? My Monster High collector, I'd rather collect the doll packs rather than the singles. I can see that. I think that's a good idea. Like, this one back here is awesome. I can't believe I have not opened that. I could open that for Halloween. That would be a good one to open during the holiday season. Somebody watched a movie. I don't know what movie it was. It was probably that anime movie we were talking about. Um, yes, I prefer... new because... Her face isn't much cute and kawaii look. Hey, that's funny because I don't really like the kawaii look. She looks good though. Her eyes are nice and big, so Laguna looked good, better before. Still a bit too much makeup and whatnot. The first edition Monster High dolls were strung together with elastic. You mean like you could pull the legs? That's that's kind of strange. The first editions have elastics close to vintage Mutu and um, gummy between the lag joints. Whoa, that's super weird. They would be cool though. I think um there are like Blythe or I saw like on um 
on one of the other channels they showed that make dolls that they showed that they were all strung together with elastic bands so every joint so I think that's probably that must be how they, that they were made I prefer, I prefer per, I don't know what that is I prefer the new body because the new body has more quality joints and stronger yeah I think the newer ones are definitely stronger and not as thin I also don't like everything here's the thing about Monster High everything all the changes when I <laughs> let me start over when I first discovered Monster High I was like this is cool these are daughters and sons of the classic Hollywood monsters this is really cool um, they're pretty cool and when I would look at them and when I would think hmm what what would I change I would think oh I would really like these accessories if they weren't painted I would like these arms and lag joints if they weren't so thin I would like if they weren't having as much makeup on I would like if they simplified the colors and the outfits and everything that I wished for so it's probably my fault that, <laughs> that the reboot looks the way it does because they turned it into everything that I wish that they would have made it because everything's a little more hunkier and chunkier see how thin and delicate and intricate this is I know that is why a lot of people like them but it's just not as cute as I would have wanted it to be and now they're just a lot more toy like and that's what I like look this purse can open that's really awesome and I love Egyptian and scarab stuff so that's really cool uh, this look at this thing speaking of Egyptian stuff I love my treasure hunter sets by imagine next now that I went on that rant let me catch up with what you guys were saying yes um, the first edition oh I already read that part um, no it's their hip joints but now they have plastic joints yeah uh, well at least it was just their hip hip joints like masters of the universe people kept saying the reboot articulation full articulation was really bad so I would run off into each arm <laughs> um, how's the hair ours was so greasy oh let's see I just discovered I'm gonna do a video on this but WD-40 works amazing to remove the grease so I just spray some WD-40 in, wash it out, it takes it out. This lagoon is a bit greasy, not as bad as some of the other ones, and this one also not that greasy. These are definitely passable, that I wouldn't have to do anything to them. The hair doesn't look great though, but it's definitely softer than the Monster High family. As much as I love the way they look, they have not very good quality hair. Hi, Tuhunky. I'm also a new subscriber. Have you seen Diamond Stollies? LOL. Um, yeah, Diamond Stollies is awesome. Can you show a comparison with one of the new figures so we can see what you mean? Um, no. Yes. <laughs> I guess I should stretch my legs. I'm not I'm not prepared for this kind of stuff. I'm still here, don't go away. I guess I should I guess I could take you over so it doesn't get too bored. Look. Look, I'm drying some of my laundry. All right. So, this is where I keep the Ever After Highs over in this section. Just because, look, there's Luke. And there's other Luke. Just because it's easier. Mm -hmm. 
this will make for more interesting viewing. Hey, Noodle More. Hey, look at this. Noodle More sent me this. Isn't this here? Oh, this is a great example. This is the best example ever. Here, why don't I bring this over? Which way do we turn? Wait, that's my ceiling. Okay, see how bright and colorful and cute these ones are? Just simplified, nice. This one, just a little more old. It looks like it's their mother, doesn't it? Doesn't she look like their mom? Yeah. I don't know, just cute pops of color. More like 50s, more deco-y. Really like this set really like that style. Alright, I can't go back and read. It's too hard. Guys, you're just going to have to repeat yourself if I haven't answered your questions. Where did you find your Wave 1 Lizzie? She was impossible to find in Montreal. I think I got her at uh... A, t a toy store called Toys, Toys, Toys here, actually. But we also had a... We have a Mattel outlet here, or we had a Mattel outlet here. It's now closed. So I got a lot of stuff there, too. So it was lucky that Mattel is in the neighborhood. I'm totally going to open this. Yes. I'm going to probably soon. Okay. Let's take a look at this Laguna. She's got... I think that's a crayfish in her hair. That's kind of really gross and spooky. It's flat. Here's a good argument for, oh, the new ones are so two-dimensional. Look at how two-dimensional that hat is. It's a little better, though, I'd have to say, than having a hollow back. At least it doesn't have a hollow back. Penny from the It Must Be Based on Courtney Jester. No, I think um, Courtney Jester is based on the clown from It, if anything. That is an old, that is a very old 1980s movie that they just remade. You want her shoes? Look, they seem to just paint one thing. Very similar shoes on these ones. Very similar shoes. And they're not as chunky, like I said. But, let's, the dress has three layers. So that's pretty sweet, don't you think? You gotta like that. Just like petals. And... And it's stitched in the back, though. That's cool that one layer is that shiny material. And there's her necklace. And her hair is okay. Pretty sweet. I want Frankie and Draculaura. Frankie and Draculaura from what line? I don't personally like the Laguna doll. Oh, all right. Tell me how you really feel. Uh, are you and Diamond's Dolly's friends? Well, I just met her here on um, YouTube. She is a recent subscriber. She's very nice. You should check out her channel. Um, gorgeous and pink. Oh, the shoes, yes. Um, I am not even going to ask why you have a Ouija board. 
The Ouija board I got from Toys R Us. It's made by Hasbro. It is definitely going to be in an upcoming review for the Halloween season in October. So through the month of October, I will be doing more spooky toys, which includes Monster High. A lot of Monster High. Probably not as many Ever After Highs. I love the old Monster High dolls better than I do the new ones. New Monster High dolls I'm not really keen on. Well, Mandy, I feel the op opposite. That's not true, because I am keen on the old ones as well. Here's um, Laguna's purse. It uh, it doesn't open. That's funny. Cleo's opens and hers doesn't. They're very similar purses. Hers is a jellyfish. Her is, hers is like a, what do you call that, a dream catcher um, scarab. I love the old Monster High dolls better than I do the new ones. I read that Ever After High should be on the same level as Monster High. Monster High has a billion dollars, but I don't know what Ever High is worth. I don't know if either of them are worth very much now. I think they were too much makeup because they were in high school and now that but first year okay I think what you're trying to say is yeah I think they're in like junior high school and this ain't no junior high school girl I know What do you think Ever After High will come out with new dolls? Uh, after the back to school ones? I like the back to school line. I don't know. Have we seen anything? Do you guys know? I can't remember if we've seen anything past back to school. I do, like I said, I earlier in this video... I really like the new Cleo that looks like a ballerina. The ballerina Cleo. I think that's a really cool line. Please do not play with the Ouija board. You're going to end up having golf and smoker... <laughs> balls come out? I don't know what that means. But it's not me that's going to play it. The Lukes. The Lukes are going to use the Ouija board. It's made by the same company that makes, um, that makes, what are they called? Baby Alive. Same toy company. So I think they're going to enjoy playing with it. I love your Halloween and Christmas videos. Thank you, Taylor Swift, for life. <laughs> I like Taylor Swift. I don't know if I can name any songs that she sings. But um yeah, there'll be there'll be Halloween videos. I hope I hope they'll be as good as previous years. Hi Too Hunky, watching a live stream for the first time. So entertaining, really? I apologize. Um I'm a new subscriber. Yay. <laughs> Diamonds Dollies mentioned you to me, and I'm glad she did. Well, thank you. I'm glad she did, too. She's very nice. What food are you eating? I'm eating a... They call it a power fruit blend. <laughs> Dark sweet cherries, blueberries, and black berries. What? Dark sweet cherries, blueberries, and blackberries. I thought this had stra I thought they had strawberries in them. They're all. It's like. It's like all dark fruit. That's really cool. 
Um, mm, mm, mm. Are you into any games? I'm sorry, I'm not into any games. The only game that I ever used to play a lot was called Amazing World. And it's like, um, I don't know, Sim City, but it's for, it's like little cute baby animals running around. It's adorable. And it's really fun at Halloween time. So I actually pr probably try to play it again. It's called Amazing World. It's made by Gans, the stuffed animal company. And the same people that make Webkins. And it's a Canadian company. And it's really, really cute. So, I don't know if it still works so well. I don't know if a lot of people are on it anymore. But I really did enjoy it. And I used to take out my shopping addiction there. Because, you know, I would build up points and do shopping online instead of doing it in real life. But... Lately, I've been doing it in real life instead. Um, do you have Roblox toys? No, but they are on sale this week at Toys R Us, so I probably should pick some up. You want to see Draculaura? Here she comes. There are three in this set. They're very cool. This was sent to me by the most wonderful Brian and Veronica, actually. I don't know how to open it. Wow, it's, it's hard to open. I don't know why I'm not just ripping it open. That's what a normal person would do. Sometimes when I watch reviews and I see people rip them open, I'm like, <gasps> and I'm gonna throw it out. I just, I don't know why. I have to do it really neatly for some reason. It's an OCD thing, I guess. happening. Draculaura is still my favorite. You mean Draculaura in general is your favorite? My nan has bigger biceps than you. Your grandmother has bigger biceps than me? That's crazy. Is she a bodybuilder? Wait, did I read... Did you... Does that say man or nan? Am I too late? Am I too late to read that? Maybe it said man, which would be... That would be okay. No, you said nan. <laughs> you said your grandmother. I bought, buy all of my Barbie dolls on eBay. eBay is really expensive for Canadians to buy from. We ha we get shipping is very expensive to Canada. Hmm. It it's just me or do fashion dolls these days focus on display rather than dolls? No wonder they look so messed up. There are many kinds of dolls. If you're a doll collector, Barbie makes 
amazing dolls that you can collect. Um, what's the name of that company? Integrity Toys makes incredible collector dolls. If you want collector dolls, they're out there. These dolls are for children. Children used to, just used to be more tacky back in 2010 when Monster High first came out. They had to evolve a little bit. Um, things aren't the same. Things look much different from the 80s and to the 90s and to... Oh, now her hair is very gluey. She's going to need some WD-40 in this. She's cute, though. I have another one of these. I don't think she has the waist belt. I think that's a new addition to this doll. Definitely this should have been a pool review, though. Can... What do you think of repainted Monster High dolls? Um, I think as... I don't want to collect them because, like I said, I like toys and more simplified things more. I really do like the people. I love seeing what people do. There's one person who follows me and I follow. Her name is Doll's Brand New Look here. She might be here right now. She does incredible art pieces and... They're like, it's not, I don't see, I don't think of them as toys. I think of them as art or, uh, art, statues. They're like incredible pieces of art. I don't think of them as toys as all, at all. I have great respect for them. So, she came with some suntan lotion. Being a vampire, I think she needs a lot of that. And this basket is really cool. You can definitely store a lot of stuff in that. And then she has this tiny little beach towel. I'm always disappointed in the towels because it's just a cut up piece of fabric. Oh look, there's, there's Doll's brand new look now. Follow her. Real, she does really amazing things. Amazing things. And they're scary, so Halloween is the right time to follow her. But when you are, when you in the UK, they're quite reasonable priced on eBay. Well, you're very lucky, Mandy. I wish that the shipping was definitely cheaper for Canadians. Amazon has good shipping. Toys R Us has good shipping. Amazon.ca has good shipping. And then Poppy Parker doll are too expensive. Um, um, debit um, 400 pounds on eBay. That's crazy. All right, have, have I showed you her? I guess not. So, I like her bubblegummy shoes. They're translucent, which is awesome. I always like something that's translucent. I even notice that the shoes aren't as thick and chunky as they are now. I love the bathing suit. I love this vinyl that they put on all of the bathing suits. I think that's really sweet. And... And I love glasses on dolls. I always think that they look really cool. Personally, I never wear sunglasses because I don't. It leaves indents in my nose, and also it just I get too hot anyway. And I like the sun in my face, so I avoid sunglasses. I own a lot, but I just don't wear them. These are necessity now that I'm old. Er. Amazon has good shipping, but a lot of the time the dolls are twice the price. Yeah, you gotta get stuff on sale at Amazon in Canada. Hi, two hunky toys. I'm also new. Hey, thanks, Monster High. You said that all right, already. And no, I'm not dating dolls, Diamonds Dollies. 
she lives in another country very very far away I try to learn as many languages to get access to dolls on other kinds of eBay like for example um, Spain yeah I know I I do the same thing with only with England though sometimes I do have to order stuff from Amazon UK and Amazon United States of course what's your favorite doll you own oh gee It's probably going to be, I don't know, maybe a Create a Monster? The Boy Collection? Oh, no, it's Luke. Right now, it's, it's Luke's. It's the Luke's. I'm sorry, there was never any question. You guys are the best. They feel, they're a little insecure because they're not dressed right now. So, just stick those guys back here. Probably before the Luke's, it would have been Baby Skeletor. Good afternoon, handsome. Um, who's handsome? Sorry, I must have sent it twice. That's all right, Monster High official. <laughs> Um, hey, <laughs> hey guys, if you people are complaining about the quality of the new Monster High dolls, then do something about it. Uh, the quality is better for the new Monster High dolls. If you don't like the new Monster High dolls, you should probably be collecting some kind of other toy line. Because that's what they look like now. Sorry, I'm, I don't mean to be mean or anything. I'm just telling you what's what I like. And, and what is being produced right now. I'm opening the Spectra right now. Uh-huh. This is the, I don't know, the first wave of Picture Days. I think it's the first wave. You can correct me if I'm wrong. I do have the whole collection of these in box. How? Mm, mm. Um, my is the J Jackson, Jekyll, and Claude. Oh, those are good ones. Let's see. Um, love the Luke's how you talk to them in the videos. Oh, thank you. I definitely have to do more. Um, yeah, Noodle Moore has, has like spoken up because Spectra made an appearance. Boy, does he like her. Hi, Diamond Stollies. Your cronies are making a big fuss. She looks great in here. This is the first package today to come with a stand. So I guess this one's way more deluxe. This is my first time opening this one. Is this my first time opening a Spectra? No, I opened the Mall Monsterista Spectra, which is, the Mall Monsterista set is pretty sweet. I apologize that most of you are unable to find that in your country. No, oh, look, look what's happening from the back of her head. What's that? She's got some Jerry Curl product shining through. Oh yeah. You don't know how many of these tab things that I find around my house. So much plastic always showing up.
Okay. It's funny because this is super, super soft. I don't know where all that grease was coming from. Mm-hmm. Oh, man. <laughs> See? This is what I'm talking about quality. She's already falling apart. These arms, the arms on these ones, they don't fall apart. Oh. Okay. This is Noodle Moore's favorite. Okay, so I, I won't say anything too bad about it. One of the things that I love are the translucent. Man, that is cool. I have never seen a hand that beautifully translucent. How much stuff can I rip off of her? Where's the instructions? Does it say? Oh, yeah, her hands come off. That means I can take these for myself. Hand. So cool. Uh-oh. They're really hard to put in. I always feel like I'm going to... Again, really flimsy. I feel like I'm going to break them by sticking them back... Oh! I just bent it! Ugh. Really hard to get them back in. Abby and Laguna are totally... <laughs> I'm here. Hey, Merhuman, thanks for coming by. What is what is Ray Ann Toys saying? Loves Abby and Laguna and Torali and Cleo and Draculaura and Frankie and Spectra and Claudine and Howleen. I think you love everyone. <laughs> okay, those laggings are pretty sweet. Um, I guess she, like, working at a diner, she's got an apron on. Um, look how it's fastened in the package. Let me see if I can fix that. Let's just take that off. Uh, uh, the, the skirt, no daughter of mine. Let me tell ya. The skirt's a little inappropriate. But I guess because she has the laggings on that it's okay. Her hair is extremely soft. Extremely soft, Andy. And then these things are really cool. Like, it's a pretty cool outfit. I wonder, is that supposed to go over the skirt or under it? Let me get her skirt back on again. Yeah, this video was not supposed to be me bad-mouthing the um, originals. But it's just I just realized how much more I like the new ones than these. I might have to sell all my old ones. But this is a really cool outfit. It's a little too detailed for me. There's a lot going on here. This is, again, the rule... Um, remove a couple accessories before you walk out the door. You can see her necklace and mesh sleeves. And, oh, look at her feet. Because they're translucent. Whoa. I wonder how much of her legs are. Starts just at the knee. Look at that cool foot. Like a glass foot. That's sweet. Um, Ronnie, would you wear that outfit? So yes, there's a lot of detail. But... The arms are really, the arms are really too thin. So now that I've seen the new ones, I do like that better. Let's take a look at her earrings. 
Did anybody else have earrings that I didn't show? No. They're really cool earrings. They've got a heart with a keyhole in them, I believe is what's going on there, hanging from a chain. Uh, the other earring is a key. What? And it's a skullette head. That's really cool. It's a skeleton key. I'm down with that. Those are super cool details. The necklace is very simple. I think I've seen that reused before on Ari. These are very weird. Okay. And because it's picture day, she comes with a lot of stuff. Look at the back of the packaging. I like all the texture and stuff and the design here. When am I doing a giveaway? As soon as I reach 5,000 subscribers. Well, not as soon as, because it'll probably happen during, during Halloween. And I really do want to focus on some spookier toys during Halloween. But maybe. Oh, this is awesome. Are these stickers? This is sweet. I think these are stickers. Those are awesome. Look, there's Invisibility. I didn't even know that he was out during this time. 2012, he wasn't. He wasn't even released yet, and they put him in here. Very cool. And then we've got some staff. Uh, wouldn't you love to get this Invisible Man? Is that Billy's dad? He would be so cool to get. This is an awesome book. What is this? And then... We get some signatures, I guess, for the yearbook. And then there's a place you can put the stickers in here in the sticker album. And look at all the characters in here. A lot of these toys weren't even made yet. That is so awesome. It's such a shame that we didn't get any more of that raggedy guy. And there's some signatures from them in the yearbook. This is a sweet book. That's This is my favorite part of the set. Very cool stickers. Um, he was out. He was just invisible. <laughs> Funny. Um... Um, don't be foolish, Diamond Stallies. I want a new Monster High character with purple because I don't like Spectra. Well, Spectra is mostly pink, and I like Spectra. There's nothing wrong with Spectra. I like her accent. She's nothing like... Wait, sorry, I like Ari. Wait, did you say you didn't like... Wait, I got... Maybe I get confused there. What did you say? I uh, I boo, 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 a character with purple because I don't like Spectra. Oh, don't say you don't like Spectra. Do you know who? Wraith. Is that his name? I hope we get him. And he, his color scheme seems to be purple, isn't it? I love this bag. It came with the Ari Fashion Pack. This one's even better in silver. I think this is just so cool. You can even unclip the chain from it, and you could wear this as a necklace if you wanted to. But I think that's probably the coolest bag Monster High has ever made. It's definitely one of my favorites. It reminds me of something I would have seen in 80s styles. It's very 80s. And I always liked like a wooden handle or a kind of maybe it could have been like a Bakelite handle. Very sweet. Very cool design there. What's this? I don't even know what that is. Mm 
here's the bottom of the stand. You get yourself a classic Monster High stand. They used to come with all the sets. And then we have a portfolio. Somebody tell me what these are called. There's like a brand name that somebody calls them. Yeah, they have some kind of cool name when they're some kind of certain brand name. But it's a, you know, it's a binder. And it opens. I don't want to open it. I, I don't like non-mechanical hinges because the tension wears and those things break. So I showed you inside. There's no details. It's just blank. You could put a sticker in there if you wanted to. Hairbrush, hairbrush, hey. Oh, is that a hairbrush? Oh, I never saw one of these in any of the new sets. I love, I do love this design. I guess it's very masculine, but it's really cool. I love the textures and stuff. Kind of reminds me of Ever After High, even though it's a more modern take on how they do their designs. Hey, Jordan, stop for, thanks for stopping in. Um, wait, Jordan, you're saying bad things, though, and your, 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 whatever, your comments are being flagged, so be careful what you say here, please. Um, weren't they called, um, zippets or something? Oh, there's, like, it's an American company, and the... I don't know. There's references that people make to these things. Like something Finder or my Jazzer Kaiser or... I don't know. I can't remember what it is. I have a 1975 Barbie doll. It costs me $50 on eBay. Mandy, that is too much money. 1975 Barbies go for quite cheap. Unless, well, I don't know how deluxe it was. I looked at Doll's brand new look, really fantastic. Yeah, she does great stuff. My, my, um, my, my pleasure. Yeah, don't swear, Jordan. It's a good thing YouTube flags people who are bad. All right, so let's um, take a look at what we got here. So we have this Draculaura. And she's in her bathing suit. All right, well, you're definitely going to have to enter my giveaways that are coming up really soon. And we'll see. Um, if anybody knows a good um, giveaway calculator, one of the things that, you know, randomly chooses, please let me know in, in the comments. And here is the Cleo. She looks great. I think her hair turned out the best. I don't know. So the Spectra has great hair too. Mhm, mm mhm. Mm they look good. If I had if I had never seen these, I would really really like these. And then there's Laguna, with her flimsy joints and fins. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, looking good. Really sticky hair. She needs, um, she needs the WD-40 treatment the most. And then, here we go with Spectra. The translucence on her, amazing. The laggings are pretty sweet. This is weird, this jellyfish shirt. Um, best purse award goes to Spectra for sure. Here are the other purses. Oh, here's another purse too. And um, here's the portfolio. Pendexaflex? No, I don't know if that's Pendaflex. Don't think that's that's not it either. Who who do voodoo? Is that the guy's name? 
was a Comic-Con exclusive. Yeah, I know. I'll never get that. The only Ever After High thing that I don't have is that, uh, what's her name? What's the Little Red Riding Hood name? See, 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 why don't I read one of my boxes? How come I forgot what her name was? Cerise. She's the only one I don't have. I don't have that Comic-Con thing. I don't have the, the Raven one either, but they reproduced that one with a plastic headdress, so I kind of have that one. He's not reading my comments, just ignoring this watchers. He's not reading my... I'm sorry if I didn't read your comment. I just read that one. I can't read every comment. San Diego Comic Con Cedar Wood. Yeah, that's the one. Cerise Hood. No, I have the Cedar Wood. In fact, I have two of them. Should I give away a Cedar Wood? Do you think anybody would enter that contest? My 1975 Barbie dolls, original, that's why it cost 50 pounds in England. English money, not American. Well, it's pretty much the same right now. At least compared to the Canadian dollar. Oh, you guys would enter the Cedar wood competition. Okay. Good to know. Trapper. Trapper Keeper. Thank you, Soul Trainer. That's exactly what I was trying to say. Trapper Keeper. How come it took you so long? Is the delay that long? That, Or did you have to look that up? Let's go back to 2010, when Monster High was, like, really good. <laughs> you know I don't agree with you. Apparently, let's go back to 2010, when, when now your legs are falling off of your 2010 dolls, because the elastics are rotting in them. That is what happened. How Monster High is like... Oh! No! Roblox Gamer Girl. Oh, thank you, Diamonds Dollies. You saved that money, though. Don't... Don't be, like... Yeah, you could have used that for the shipping. Remember that shipping? Unbelievable. Art Pop, Jason, that noise was bug. That no noise. That no noise was bug? Oh. You know what? It was probably like a speeding car. My fan is making noise too. But no, there's no there's no bugs. There will be if I keep my lights on late at night. They'll come in through the screens. What do we do to enter the giveaway? I don't know. You guys have to tell me what's a good giveaway company. I have to Google the name. I used to use them in the 80s, but my memory was sketchy. Oh, thank you, Soul Train. Awesome. Wait, now I forget. What something trapper? Trapper keeper. Trapper keepers. So funny. No wonder nobody knew because I didn't realize that there was an eighties thing. Do you have two thousand thirteen Ever After High dolls? Yes, I have every single. 
I have every single one. See, they're over there, and they're there. I have everything in box except for the San Diego Comic Cons. All right? Do you want to see them? Should I get them? I'll get to you as soon as I can. <laughs> um, what's your favorite Ever After High character, and did you like the doll version? Okay. For the for the show, I really like. I really like Maddie, which is weird for me because she's so crazy. And, but I like Raven. Raven's got the best story because she's going against her her, who she's supposed to be. So I really like that dynamic. But, and, and all of the toys look fantastic. But Hunter's probably my favorite because you know he looks the most like me. He's got dark hair. And I had that hairdo before, where it was cut like that. So I like him. I'm sorry, I don't know about giveaway competitions because I've never won anything in my life, so I wouldn't know. Um, well, that's probably your problem. If you know something about them and you enter them all the time, then your chances of winning are probably higher. My favorite Ever After High is Poppy O'Hare. That is a very good choice. I like her because she was the first one not to be a royal or a rebel. She chose both or neither, and I thought that was really cool. And I can definitely relate to that the most. Because I think there's a little bit of royal and a little bit of rebel in everyone. I thought you were putting stuff away. Still looks like a warehouse in there. It's a work in progress. It's really, really, it's so much better. But, yeah. This is, this is, uh... I was going to say this is my other stuff, but no, that's also, a lot of that's my other stuff and toys. <laughs> and then I'm building a wall of boxes here because there's not enough room in the closet to fit all of the boxes, even though the closet is filled with boxes already. But it's happening. I, I, I have plans. It's going to work. Um, I love Cerise Hood Ever After High dolls. Yeah, she's pretty cool. I really love them all. Hello, Oopa. Oopa, poop, Oopa, Oopa. Uh, Barba Papa? Uh, what's your favorite Ever After High San Diego Comic Con exclusive doll? The Cedar one is pretty sweet. Um, but... And then, and then, so is, so is the cedar wood one, but the Cerise, sorry, did I say the Cerise, the Cerise one with the fur and the hood and everything, it's just, that's so cool. But I really, really do like the cedar wood one too. And the Raven's pretty awesome as well. Luckily there's only three. Notice me, Alan, I notice you. Um, my job is sleeping. That's a good job. <laughs> good night. Um, he's saying... He's saying... Um, yeah, I'm saving up to open my own toy store. Toys R Us is closing. Somebody's gonna have to have toys. May as well be me, right? Do you have any jobs besides YouTube and modeling? Yeah, I do social media for social responsible companies. I want some Monster High in the giveaway. Whatever 
we are where are. Notice me. I noticed you, all right? Get over it. You have quite a lot of toys and dolls, more than what I have, at least I can walk around my room. It's a problem, Mandy. It's a big problem. Why will you say it's my name? It's Angel. Hey, Angel. What would be the ideal job? Oh, I just want to be a YouTuber. I just want to do this. This is what I would do. So if I get more subscribers, then I can do it. So like, comment, share, and subscribe if you haven't already. If you're watching this video and you haven't liked it yet, why not do that? Thanks. It really helps out a lot. That's what some YouTubers say. That's who, what the YouTubers that have lots of subscribers say. So maybe I should say that. Hey Brazil, thanks for watching. Hey, welcome back, Sh Sarah, S Sahara. Are you sad that Ever After High is going to end? No, Ever After High is not going to end. Why would you think that? How can Ever After High end when it looks like this? There's just so much of it. Do you own every Ever After High? It can go on. It can go on for as long as you want it to. Please say hi to Brazil. Hey Brazil, I can't wait. Um, I see the two Snack and Lukes, or three. I only have the two. I'm waiting for I'm waiting for the Puerto Rican snack and loop to go on sale. And then I'll pick him up too. How many there would? Now people are speaking different languages, so I can't... Puppies or dogs? Puppies. I wish you give away bears because I have a green one. Wish you give away your bears. Which bears? I don't... You mean, I don't... I have that bear. That's the only bear that I can think that I have. You mean brunette. Oh. <laughs> yeah, no, but he, look, he looks like a little cute Puerto Rican baby. But yes. He's got a darker... He's got a darker complexion. You like Demi Lovato? I have no idea who Demi Lovato is. I only did the like the video to stop panicking. Oh, thank you. Definitely, definitely like my video. Thank you for your likes. <laughs> I have the blonde one named Luke. Me too. They're all named Luke. I'm keeping their names as Luke. I'm not renaming them. It says on the box that their name is Luke. That is their name. Mm. My berries are very good. Here's the Spectre that I opened. She's pretty sweet. She's got some crazy weird sleeves on her. They look like leaves. She reminds me of Stevie Nicks. Um, bye Roblox Gamer Girl. Thanks for stopping in. I hope um, you learn to like the reboot more. They're pretty sweet. 
love the bright colors and the simplicity and the sturdy joints and the thicker arms. Um, um, the sign and the, oh, I'm missing all the comments. I can't read this fast. What's your favorite music? Because I like to listen to Kayo Pasco because I'm, I do Carnival. I don't know who, oh, Calypso. Because <laughs> I do Carnival. I like Calypso. I don't like reggae, but I like Calypso. I like Harry Belafonte because it's older music. I like I like music that's traditional, like older music, but I also like scary adult contemporary. This would be how you describe the music I like. I like bands like Nick Cave and the Tinder Sticks and Leonard Cohen. Can you watch the Gavin Juice doing the Disney thing like making the ears. I don't know what that means. I don't know what that sentence means. Love Spectre's outfit. She looks really good. See it, Roblox Gamer Girl. Oh, see it, Roblox. Spectre, sorry. S please subscribe to me. You don't have an avatar. I could only subscribe to somebody who has an avatar. What are Luke... Where are Luke and Luke? They're right here. Here they are. They're being good. They don't have any clothes on. It's really hot. So they're just staying cool. I'm a professional carnival dancer. Too. I've got a trophy that I won in 2012. That's awesome, Mandy. I am also, I am also a professional dancer. Here's Dracula in her bathing suit. Leonard Cohen is one of my favorite singers. I have all his albums. Me too, Diamond Stollies. He's sweet. Disney Channel audition tape. It's called What's It? The First Words, okay? Disney Channel audition tape. Gavin Juice. It's called what? It's the first words, okay? I'm gonna have to look up this Gavin Juice character. What does he say? Hey there, hi there, ho there, to all our company. M I C see you real soon K E Y Y because we like you M O U S E Mickey Mouse Does it go like that? Is that what you're talking about? Or was that strictly the 50s version? And I was a queen at Notting Hill Carnival. I'm going to have to Google this, Mandy. You need to leave a comment on one of my other videos. So I remember to Google this Notting Hill business of yours. Not Gavin Juice. Guava juice. Oh, I love guava juice. It's delicious. 
guavas are good. I prefer to eat the whole fruit, though. Hey there, it's... Question mark from Gavin Juice. Messed up. Do you listen to the Killers? They sang my bright side. Mr. Brightside? Um, I think I listened to the Killers many years ago. I think, I think people used to tell me that I looked like the singer from the band all the time. He used to, used to stop me on the street and ask me if I was him. I think I used to like them, but that was a long time ago. Guava Juice is a YouTuber. Okay, I'm gonna... Somebody please leave a comment in, in the below so I can remember to look up Guava Juice, the YouTuber. Whenever you guys do this, though, to me, and you tell me to look somebody up, I get really embarrassed because I've never heard of them. I go, I, I, go, I Google them, I look them up on YouTube, and I realize that they have like 7 million subscribers and I'm like, oh, whoops, I probably should know who this person is being a YouTuber. But I really only, I only watch toy YouTube channels. I watch some health and fitness ones, I guess. And I just started watching some Miranda Sings I started watching because the net the Netflix show. And um Graveyard Girl, I really enjoy. She's super funny. Um, are there any new there's no there's not a lot of um there's not a lot of boys on here. Josh Darnett I knew from from Vine, and I really like him. He's a really good guy and his family's really cute. He's got a really sweet wife awesome family so I subscribe to them they don't actually have very many subscribers but you should definitely follow Josh Darnett and family because it's a very good channel he does challenges mostly it's not ever after high and be and because they want to have an animation with dolls because all products are selling on the way if you didn't have noticed. Oh my god, now you mentioned it, you do look like the main singer. I don't know, uh, I don't, I don't remember what his name is. You can't watch everything, Jason. I know I can't. And that's because they always dis are adults collecting. Um, I know a lot about guava juice. Wanna know some things? Yeah, you can tell me some stuff about guava juice. Do you watch the British original YouTubers? Is that their name? The British originals? The British original? Was YouTube invented in Britain? Were the first YouTubers from Britain? I'm confused by that statement. La last one at the end. Hey, theirs is the Guava Juice, and you watched Nickelodeon. I've never watched Nickelodeon. Mile makes Mickey Mouse ears and smiles, and it says Nickelodeon. Oh, that sounds really weird. I saw... I saw... Uh... <laughs> I saw... what are they called? Oh... Uh, I just saw a toy tuber make Mickey Mouse ears. It's the froggy... the froggy lady... the froggy stuff. I saw her do a craft the other day. I think it was a live one and she made Mickey Mouse ears. Is it like that? And then you wear them and stuff? I keep messing up on guava juice. What I mean to say... I like to watch all other YouTubers who plays with toys and dolls. One of them is My Froggy Stuff. I love My Froggy Stuff. One of my favorites now. P.S. Toy Reviews is also one of my favorites now. 
Um, most of the other people have stopped making videos or are really critical about toys. I guess they're be they have become jaded. The old toy collectors, a lot of them have moved over to gaming. I'm not really into gaming, so it's coming very few. But I really do like the fro and oh Disney car toys who just changed their name to Sandra Rue family. I love them, and they are really nice and very supportive. They just made a funny parody Barbie video of me. It was so funny. I really loved it. you got to check that out. I linked it in my videos below, and um, I guess it's called, like, Featured on Other Channels, and it's really funny. No, the original British YouTubers are the first YouTubers from Britain that got majority majorly big like Godzilla <laughs> no like Zuel Zola Potterless Bogs Point Pointless Blogs and Marcus Butler. I have a feeling that I would have a problem with their I don't know. I don't I don't always get British humor. But perhaps I'll check those out. Hopefully somebody will leave a comment below when this video goes live and tell me the names of some of these people. And Mandy's giving emoji cons to me and I went to Notting Hill Carnival when I was younger. I got to sit on a float. Well Mandy's the one dancing on those floats. Um, no, it's the Mickey Mouse ears and you don't wear it like you do like you know the people that say hey it's <laughs> and you're watching Disney Channel <laughs> in the 50s I was watching the Disney Channel so Guava Juice was a group Wasabi Productions was in a group Wasabi Productions and he left to make his own channel and he started the gaming and then he did a lot more I know where I know more info but I know a lot so I can't tell you a lot oh yeah don't tell me too much I think we've given guava juice a little too m much um, recognition and if he's a gamer that's not something that I'm interested in. I'm sure he's really funny if he's original and um, very successful, though, here on YouTube. Go Mandy! I think how Halloween... 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 I think Halloween... Halloween... Halloween's... Am I having a seizure? I think Halloween's story is that she feels like nothing when others are more successful than her. That's sad. But in the Guava Juice one, it's so funny. I laughed my head off. All right, I'll check out Guava Juice. What a silly name. Um, it's me, Jordan. Hey, Jordan, don't swear. Can you... Look, you are already flagged for something you already said. Can you sub to my channel? Oh, it, <laughs> it doesn't like you saying that either. That flags you. Diamonds and Hunky collab, please. Want to see a toy haul or unboxing video? Yes, I am going to send Diamonds a box back because she is so nice to send me one. It's probably the best I can do. I'll have to find out what she wants and what she likes but she has every single LOL that was ever made, pretty much. How can I have an avatar? Well, I don't. you have to upload a picture. Does it seem to you that Teresa Dahl and the Garden Ghouls would have been more suited for Ever After High's theme? Yes. I think they're very Ever After High-esque. Very, very, very. Sorry for swearing before. That's good, Jordan. Just don't do it again. 
and you can't ask me to sub to you can't ask people to sub to your channels either because apparently you'll be flagged for that as well just click the money sorry for swearing um one dollar he waves magician's hand making the ears with the horse masks on lol so funny you mean you have to give him money and then he does stuff he sounds horrible um, Amy Lily and Mommy Toy Reviews channel. Love your channel. It is a shame that a lot of kids play with computers rather than playing with toys. My children included. They play too much computers. They do still enjoy toys though. Yeah, I like toys more than games. It is a shame that people are playing, but it's also, I don't know, it's a lot cheaper to play games than it is to play with toys. And you're not, like, you know, wasting plastic resources and stuff. So there is a lot to be said about not use, playing with toys. I'm going to stretch my legs out. Um, my dad hits me. He just kicked me in the B... <laughs> Jordan! I certainly hope your dad doesn't hit you, or I'm going to have to beat him up for you. Um, I'll just come to Canada, and we can do a proper collab. Don't come to Canada. Um, no, it's the number one... It's the number one zero zero, like one, oh, one o'clock a.m. and p.m., but no a.m. or p.m. Um, do you think the dolls behind you should spend more time in the gym? They have weak abs, man. No way. Those guys are tough. These guys have been working out. They work out constantly. L LOL, me and Jason are addicted to toys. Yes, toys are the best. Um... Um, sleeping versus zombie gaga monster high dolls because I've got two of them zombie gaga monster high dolls I have one and I'll probably get another one one day when they're on super clearance and then that is the one that I'll open I hit him back in his butt that's good don't let daddy get away with that those guys hit me all the time but it's play and we're boxing. Do you think Ever After High has more magic than Monster High or it's the other way around? I think um I think Ever After High has more magic. Definitely more magic. Monster High has more monsters. Definitely more monsters. Um one minute. Oh every one minute that um, guava juice does something. Now I forgot what guava juice does. I've always wanted to go to Canada. Don't go to Canada. It's a good place to live, though. We have um, an okay prime minister. Like he's he's really nice, and he brings attention to issues that are important. Can I use my children as barbells if I don't have any weights ready? Yes, I definitely recommend that. Slap one on your back, do some push-ups. Definitely good. What? Sh why shouldn't I come? I'll not scary. I'm not scary, and I don't bite. <laughs> you just shouldn't come to Canada. I am planning to go to Scotland, maybe. But also, never meet anyone from the internet, ever. Never, ever, ever. Here's a lesson for you, kids. Never meet anyone from the internet. Ever. Never, never, never. It's the same as never go into a strange car or van where somebody is offering candy. Never, never, never. Not if, even if you know them. I'm in the hospital now. I'm sorry to hear that, Jordan. You probably shouldn't be using that language then because there are people that would not be appreciative of that kind of language while you're in the hospital. 
I have a problem with bullies. I have blue belt in karate. Well, it sounds like you shouldn't have a problem with bullies then. Do you tell them that you have a blue belt in karate? Do you, like, swing them around? Bullies are horrible. Don't be a bully. Do you mean Scotland in the UK? Yes, I mean Scotland in the UK. I have friends that live there. In Edinburgh. Jason likes his fans at a distance. I definitely like my fans at a distance. Sorry for swearing. Jordan, you've already apologized. Just don't swear. You don't apologize for swearing. Just don't swear. How do you upload a pic? Well, you gotta go into your profile and you check, you click on... I don't know, I don't remember how to do that. But it's in there, you just gotta go into your YouTube settings. You also have to have content. Oh, it, just because you have an avatar doesn't mean I'm gonna subscribe to your channel. You're, you have to have good content that I'm going to actually be interested in watching. Scotland is awful, man. Well, I'm sorry to hear that. If you want to a taste of Scotland, go to your local homeless shelter. That is not a very nice thing to say. Scotland is very nice. There's very good schools there. And I have some friends that live there. And, and yeah, not a nice thing to say. I'm sorry that I read that out loud. Um, okay, I understand that. <laughs> and no, I'm not a kid. You know, I'm an adult. I know, I know Mandy's an adult. Can you check out my videos, please? Um, you're going to have to leave a comment on one of my videos so that I'll be able to link and then I will check out your videos. I always do if somebody says, well, maybe not because that goes to spam, but if you word it properly and it stays not in my spam folder, then I will definitely check out your video. I mean, I check out people's channels if they're really polite anyway, so if you leave lots of comments on my... If you leave nice comments on my videos, I'm going to be interested in who you are, and of course I'm going to check out your videos. And if they're good, I'm going to definitely subscribe to your channel, especially if you review toys. I'm, um, I'm from New Scotland. I'm from Nova Scotia, which is New Scotland, and I am, I would probably say, probably one-fifth Scottish. Um, we live in the UK near to London. I have never been to Scotland, but would love to go one day. Scotland is probably very, very beautiful, very green and lush. Definitely. I've been to the south of England, and I'm sure it's very similar. Um, fans from the UK. Forbins was away, but now he's back. I guess I was on here for way too long. When are you in Scotland? Watch out for Neds. And if you don't know who they are, Google them. Are they like the Goalers in, in Canada? Or in Nova Scotia? I don't review toys. Oh, Jordan, do you play guitar? What do you do then, Jordan? I mean, I follow other people, like Miranda Sings. And normally I wouldn't f follow such foolishness, but there's some kind of, there's some intellect behind it. And I have learned to really like Colleen, so. Will you ever buy YLOL? I don't, in way back, I like Winx, been a fan of the show since it was, I probably, I didn't find any winks at a warehouse sale. Uh, I think they're all gone. I, they're a little too long and thin for me. I like things that are more chunky and hunky. 
we review toys and do skits. Well, I'll definitely check out your channel. I think I already have, though. I think I already do. I th Amy, are you are you from England? So, what other toys are you going to review for us today? Oh, um, uh, um, uh, n no more, no more. I guess I think I'm just answering questions right now. I want to go to Canada, but I live in the UK. Yes, it's very far away. Taylor Swift lives here, though. Oh, not in Canada, but she lives in North America. They are all, like, want to be gangsters. Oh, I don't like gangsters at all. Um, I encounter... Oh, no, people are typing too fast. I encounter too many coincidences. Coincidences are awesome. That means those are signs, especially if the same things are happening over and over again. Hey, what happens to baby Skeletor? Did the Lukes put him in a box <laughs> uh, he's up here he's discoloration he's discoloring he has discoloration which I'm really upset about not I'm not as upset about that as I am with the state of my hair these days just it's starting to be just like a helmet head it doesn't have any specialness um, I do music videos. Oh, I love music videos. I'll check that out. Um, I saw your comment in Miranda's video, something about her workout outfit. <laughs> um, yeah, I comment on um, Colleen's videos a lot. Uh, oh, right. I might have said that she looked really good, too. She looked really good that day that Miranda did. I make slime. Oh, that's cool. Um, I haven't made slime yet. I bought slime, though. Maybe I should open... Oh, I can review slime for Halloween. That's a good Halloween review, too. Um, I make slime. Okay. Uh, yes, we are from England. And thanks. Oh, yeah, I totally have watched your... I totally watched your stuff. You have cute daughters. Where do you prefer to buy your toys? I prefer to buy my toys at Target. Which, we don't have a Target in Canada. Because Target has amazing clearance prices, and they have great new stuff. Just a great toy collection. Just a great toy selection. I've made one video for the first time, and I made a mistake. I know it was all about my Barbie dolls, but I was a bit of a boo-boo, and it was just for a laugh anyway. Did you put it live, Mandy? I will watch that if you did. Not dolls. I can't have dolls. Sorry. I'm sorry you can't have dolls. Those are awesome. I want to meet you so badly. You can't meet me. You never meet anyone from the Internet. Ever. Never meet anyone from the internet. People from the internet are bad, bad, bad. I keep having this had coincidences that when I go to for a poop, I have to be careful what I'm reading, when I get to the public toilet, they are always out of toilet paper. Yes, that is a very common occurrence. I definitely agree. It's not fun, no. I think I hear somebody outside. Better not be somebody at my door. Do you have kids? Many. Um, how many dolls do you have? Somewhere between a thousand and ten thousand. I'm not really sure. Do you know what? Do I have? I I have to say somewhere between hundreds and ten thousand. Somewhere in between there. I'm not really a good guesser, but there's 10 right up there. Wait, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. There's 11 right up there. And then over here, there's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. And then every single one of these boxes is filled with more. So I don't know. 
somewhere between somewhere in the hundreds to somewhere in the thousands somewhere in between there and then um, I made online um, yes oh wow oh, oh boy Ah, oh, Jason, your hair looks fine. Yeah, it looks fine. It doesn't look good. Um, I made one video about my Barbie dolls. Oh, I read that. Darn. I'm so far behind. I might have to skip. We are opening the Lego Friends Advent Calendar this year. Sweet. And do skirts, skits every day. We are really excited. We did it last year, too. Thanks to... Thank, thanks that you're so nice. Oh, thank you, and thank you. I'll be sure to watch it. All right. Um, I can't. I still can't believe we have the same surname. It's a good. It's a good last name. It's very British. And and Wolverine has the same last name too. He's from Canada. He's from Alberta. I wish I lived near the beach like you. I bet it is really nice to just go for a swim whenever you feel like it. Well, I don't live that close to the beach, and now uh, I live further away from the beach, and the beach isn't that great here because it's a lake and not the ocean. I would prefer to live next to the ocean. And now, like, I, I when I go to the beach... There is a beach that is close to me, but I wouldn't really go in that water because it's too close to the city. But I can take a ferry to an island and then go to the other side, so it's way further away from the city, and it's on the opposite coast of the sh city. So that is where I like to go swimming. And it's just a, because I moved further away from there, it's just kind of too far for me to get to right now. So that part sucks. But I do live near water, and it's always important to me to live near the water. Do you have a wife? No, I don't have a wife. She left me. Um, do... Oh, wait. You're being sarcastic. No, not necessarily. I buy more books than dolls. I buy a lot of books, too, but they're books about dolls. Um, are you doing the advent calendar again this year? I don't know. I'm going to be traveling during the winter months, so I'm not sure if I can bring the calendar along with me. I don't know if I should pre-record it, or I'm, I just might not be able to do a calendar. I bought, I did a Playmobil calendar, and I have lots of calendars already bought to do, but I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to do them this year. Um, have you ever had heard of this Scottish toy called Brody? It's a wooden thing. No, but I do like wooden toys. I like Jacob's Ladder. We do not have a Target, but we have um, Asda Argogas shops and Wico shops that sell toys and dolls in London. Um, I have seen some pretty... I like the toy stores in London and in Europe. I saw some really good ones in Barcelona. Big toy stores. They have Penny Pond in Europe, and I really like Penny Pond. I wish we had Penny Pond in Canada. Can we take a 11 doll pet pack on Disney Princesses? Can we take a 11 doll pack can you take a look at that hey don't discuss lake water <laughs> i prefer swimming in the lake than the ocean but our beaches are not real um some lakes have shallow but where i'm from the lakes are usually really and you can't see the bottom i prefer not to swim in water where you can't see the bottom so but the lakes here in ontario um, are usually really shallow and they're much like an ocean it's because I guess probably because the lake is so large so that's okay but I prefer salt water definitely salt water is so healing and I mean you more buoyant in it I definitely prefer 
salt water to lake water. I'm coming home from the hospital now. Yay, Jordan, I hope you're okay. I hope your father didn't hurt you. Have you had any haunted experiences with your dolls? No. Jesse V has mentioned some, but I don't believe in ghosts, so I don't I will never have any problem with any ghosts. Um have you had haunted Oh, I read that. Um are you going to buy the Monster High Ever After High crossover book? Of course I'm going of course I'm gonna buy that. I'm probably not gonna read it. In fact I have the first chapter right here. This book was just released on paperback. And and included in the first edition of Paper Black is the first chapter of the original. The end is just the beginning. Look inside for a sneak peek at the Legends of Shadow High. And you can see here is the cover of it. And you can start reading. See the Monster High Ever After High logo cross over the first chapter of it. That's pretty cool. That's quite a lot of dolls. You got more do da days and I, oh, missed it. That is quite a lot of dolls. You got more days and I have dolls than I have oh, collecting dolls for a lifetime. Yeah, I got all these in like a year or two. Have you checked out Lego Friends and Lego Disney Princesses? Um, yeah, I really like those. They're really cute um, sizes. I always wanted to make a stop motion series with dolls, but I don't have the patience. Yeah, it takes a lot of work to do stop motion. Read it for us. But I can hardly read. Um, what do you collect the books but not read them? I don't, I don't have enough time to read them. And the, re the reason I collect the books, this is a bad example. I'll show you why I collect the books. I like olden day stuff like stuff stuff that looks like that it's in a castle I'm right here I'm coming back and these and these look like they look like old-fashioned books it's just the aesthetics that I'm drawn to. I think that they just look really good. So look at those buckles on there. They look like things that could be in a castle. So of course I'm gonna collect them. I prefer ocean water too. I live near a river, but it's dangerous to swim because of the currents. I would totally love that. I love dangerous swimming though. What I mean to say is I'm too scared to make another video about my Barbie dolls. I might get hate comments about my Barbie dolls. You don't worry about the hate comments. Hey, disable your comments and then nobody can leave any bad comments about them. That is so cool. We are so excited to read the crossover book. Yeah, I am I am too, but I don't know why I haven't read it yet. Yes, I do. I don't have time. The reason I'm doing this live video is because I didn't really have time to edit a video, so I thought to get a video up on time, this is what I would have to do. Um, story time, how you got into toys. Oh, how did I get into toys? Gee. Uh, I really like toys, and so I bought them. That's how I got into toys. That's not a, That wasn't a hard question at all. What do you do for a living? A model, right? Yeah, I do that. Um, yes, Jason, read it. Where did I put it? Oh, it's right here. 
Um, I've got over 500 books. I think I love old-fashioned looking books too. Yeah, I only like hardcovers. The only reason I got this one was because the first chapter is in it. <clears throat> the sun was barely up when Widow Tweed started the chores around the little farm. She milked the cows, fed the chickens, then began to hang the laundry out to dry. The pile of clothing moved. The widow lifted a blanket. There was a frightened fox. Oh, you poor thing. You've lost your mama. Well, don't worry. I'll take care of you. Wait a minute. That was from The Fox and the Hound. This is the story of The Fox and the Hound. You can read along with me in your book. You will notice time to turn the page when you hear the chimes ring like this. Let's begin now. That's not what that said here. That was just something that I had memorized from my childhood. Oh, I do scratch my beard. My beard is itchy. Somebody said that in one of my comments yesterday. Nap time to sleep. Bye, Jason. Hugs and kisses from Macedonia. You live in Macedonia? I didn't know. I didn't know that you were Greek. I know that Macedonians don't like to be called Greek. Have you picked a costume for Halloween? Um, I'm going to go as a surfer. I'm too scared to make any more videos about my Barbie dolls. I don't want to get hate. Just make a video, Mandy. Don't worry about what other people think or say. Oh my god, you still remember those recorded books? Yeah, they were records. What about the film strips? I got into toys from a very young age. It helped me overcome my depression and anxiety and low self-esteem. Then being bullied, oh my goodness, when I was younger and been called um, useless and ugly. That's horrible. Now I feel fab. Well, toys are wonderful and definitely therapeutic. No, not Greek. I know, Macedonian. It's very different. I wanted to write that you are pretending reading. You're, you do not have glasses. I can read without my glasses. I think the print, yeah, the print on here is fine. I think I could read with this. I don't know. I've never, I've never read a book since I've needed glasses. Oh my God, that is so true. That's horrible. End this, end this stream. I probably should end the stream because it's been two hours soon. I get hate all the time. Um, Jordan, I am not surprised. Oh, wait, no, no, you're Jaden. Who cares, really? Yeah, you can't worry about hate. Jordan should get hate mail. Jaden, you're probably okay to get. Not, you shouldn't get it. Don't be so rude, Jordan, or get off Jason's stream. Oh, that's, but isn't that also rude to say Diamond's Dollies? I get bullied a lot when I was younger. I got pushed down the stairs at my school. That's horrible. Being bullied is not cool. I saw this boy once and he wanted Monster High Barbie Bratz and all other types of dolls. His dad call, said they were for girls. Yeah, that's, that's too bad. Kids should get whatever they want. Please, it's too long. You don't have to watch it. You can stop watching. You might need um, bifocals. Yeah, these are just reading glasses. So bifocals would work perfectly. I'm not trying to be rude. Don't be rude. I have 19k subscribers. What? You have more subscribers than me. I don't like you. I'm just kidding. You can have as many subscribers as you want. I wish I had 19. Actually, I don't. I want 100k. Who are your Diamonds Crowd Control? Who are you, Diamonds Crowd Control? <laughs> oh, yeah. Diamonds, don't be... 
don't be don't be do don't be crowd controlling because people other people are gonna get angry and then it's gonna get worse and worse. Jason, that was a bit rude of me actually to say. Oh, see, she apologized. Um, have you considered contacts? No. Um, they're reading. It's just for reading. I don't think you can get reading contacts. I don't. I only need them like sometimes when I'm reading like really small print. But this is good. Like, hmm, that's an epilogue. Let's see here. <clears throat> It's morning at Monster High. The old building sits up on Monster High like, like, uh, I'm trying to think of a good simile here. I studied similes last se semester, but I'm sure new at, but I'm not a good reader. I'm still new at narrating. I'm still new at reading. It sat on a hill like a big dark birthday cake, like a hairless rock giant, like a fancy pointed hat worn by particularly well-behaved geographical features. This person really is bad at similes. Ugh, I already messed this up. I'm not supposed to say I, for starters. I am the narrator, not a character in the story. Let me start over. This is not going well. <clears throat> it actually says, <clears throat> see? It's morning at Monster High. The spiders are... See, I can't read now. See, now I need the glasses. It's morning at Monster High. The spiders are humming. Spiders hum? The termates are chittering. The wind is sliding through the shutters with an eerie whistle. A beautiful day. Oh, hey, there are Dracula and Frankie Stein walking through the massive front door, carrying their bags on their shoulders with absolutely no idea of the epic possibility... with absolutely no idea of the epic, possibly world-ending story that's about to unravel. Draculaur is a vampire, obviously. Pale pink skin, long fangs, glossy black hair, and pink highlights. A pink and black dress with polka dots. Frankie has mint green skin and black hair, shocked with thick white stripes. You can see the seams in her arms and legs where her father, Frankenstein, switched, stitched her together. Both girls are super excited. You can tell by the way they're walking. A hop in their step, nearly skipping. But Frankie is also nervous. You can tell from the shiver in her hands the shiver in her hands, the tremor in her skin. Don't forget the intro music, says Draculaura. I've got to... Oh, I've got it queued up in my eye coffin, Frankie says, holding up her coffin-shaped phone as they pass the coffin-shaped lockers. Have you got the... Sound effects, says Draculaura pulling the portable keyboard from her back, from her pack. Check. And the images, said Draculaura, the photo, the photo slideshow is totes on my eye coffin. Do you like it? You're doing well. <laughs> Loving the new book already. Um, in glasses, you look very stylish. I'm leaving. I don't you don't stop re I'm leaving if you don't stop reading. Thank you for subscribing to my channel, Mandy. My dad... Oh, Jordan, no! Jordan, stop that kind of talk. Beautiful reading, a lovely bedtime story. Yes, spoil it for us. I'm not spoiling it for us. I'm just reading the first chapter. How is that spoiling? It's from the very beginning. When you get this book... 
you just won't read the first chapter because you've already heard it. I've got bullied by teacher when I was younger because of my eyesight. I am registered blind, unfortunately. That's why I'm using the speaker thing on my phone. Oh, that's cool. But it's not cool that you can't see. And teachers that bully are not cool at all. Um, images, right, but I don't forget the special... But don't forget the special effects is Frankie handing Dracula the portable f -tacular Effect-tacular. So they have all kinds of words in here that aren't real words. That Frankie made in her lab the size of a toaster. It creates all sorts of monstrous effects. Are you sure we should use the f -tacular? says Draculaura. The other students won't have smoke clouds and ice storms in their presentations. I don't have much time to practice with it, and Draculaura plays with her hem of her skirt. It seems um, scary, but not in a good way. There's a lot of um, quotations and stuff in this. Well, maybe we don't need them, says Frankie, but they'll make our presentation voltageous. Well, of course, but getting back to the dangerous part... Uh, maybe our presentation will be great even without a spectacular. Great, Frankie. Frankie's neck bolts buzz with excitement. But great isn't enough. Not near enough. We, we're the co-founders of Monster High. All right, here's the stuff. They're actually taking it. This is a continuation from the actual new thing. They said they were the co-founders of Monster High. That means that this book is taken from the new... What do you call that? The new catalog backstory. Um, you enjoy reading. See, maybe you will go on to read the whole book. I could listen to your voice all night. It, this is becoming Reading Rainbow. I can't go anywhere. Games to show, games to go. Reading Rainbow, Reading Rainbow, Reading Rainbow, Reading Rainbow. Uh, okay, um, where was I? Um, okay, okay, I'm sure you're right. Today, the history class will give their oral presentations on the creation of Monster High. And since Frankie and Dracula kind of sort of actually founded the school, Frankie feels a wee bit of pressure to kind of sort of actually be spooktacular. They slide into their seats just as Mr. Rotter starts the class. Let's see, he says, rubbing his fingers over his pale gray forehead. I believe Marshall is up first. The small swamp monster slurps his slurps his way to the front of the class, blinks his one eye, and, and shrugs the tangled knot of his thorny vine hair out of the way. I don't know who this guy is. Sorry, unfortunately I cannot read like I said. I'm registered blind as I've only got limited eyesight left. I don't know how long I've got with my eyes. That's horrible, Mandy. I love your voice. You are a very good English teacher for me. Kiss from La France. Um, I'm apologize. I'm probably teaching you horrible English. Um, so, says Marshall, I um, lived in a swamp. I ate swamp stuff, you know. Did swamp things. Then Frankie and Drac found me and said, Hey, we're starting a school called Monster High. And hey, you could come and learn stuff and not be alone all the time. So I did. Marshall sits back down. Thank you, Marshall, says Mr. Rotter. 
lids blinking slowly over his black eyes. Next time, work on details and listen and and listing references. Okay. Well, I hope Dracula and Frankie will be an example to you all of a proper proper of a proper oral presentation. Um, I'm not. There's a lot of quotations. Diamond Dollies, would you not? Um, would you not send me money? Goodness gracious. Save that money. Okay, um, people seem to be leaving while I'm reading, so I'm gonna stop. I'm gonna stop reading, and I'm not a very good reader. And I want to thank you so much for watching. Remember to like, comment if you if you're watching right now and you haven't liked this video, like it now. And I'm sorry that this went on for so long, two hours and ten minutes. I hope that this won't stop you from and I'm hope I'm sorry about what I'm wearing and I hope this won't stop you from watching other videos that I make and thank you so much for watching remember to like comment share and subscribe and we'll see you next time